And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray, and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's Portugal versus Argentina. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Joao Cancelo starts with Rafael Guerrero as fullbacks. Ruben Neves plays alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And leading the line today is Joao Felix. The Argentina first team. Rodrigo de Paul starts alongside Leandro Paredes in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And now they get the ball rolling. Oh, it might be. Goalkeeper in charge of the situation. And played in by Di Maria. And that came off the defender, so it'll be a corner. Keen to take it short here. The delivery towards the back post. Smuggled away. Will he play it in? Happy to take on the shot. Terrific block. Joao Cancelo. It's with Ruben Neves. It's with Joao Cancelo. On to Silva. Well, nicely cut out. The attack looks promising. Chance to play it in. Can he put them in front? Well, it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. No one able to do any damage with it. Bruno Fernandes, Joao Felix, he's given us away, has eyes for goal, well the keeper made the save pretty easily in the end.
Well, couldn't keep it in. Joao Felix. Just the challenge that was required. Now, options are plenty. But the danger averted for now. Joao Felix. Chances on. Defending of the highest class to stop him. Martinez. Rafael Leao. Options in the middle. Might go ahead. And a goal to give them the lead. They have their reward. Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. But I don't think the keeper should be beaten in his near post quite so easily. I thought that was stoppable. One nil then. In danger of giving it away. Joao Felix. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Di Maria. Intelligent threaded pass here. Marcos Acuna. On to Di Maria. At times they make passing look easy. Di Maria. This could be the equaliser. Oh, but he's missed it! He's completely failed the test! Well, that was a big opportunity, and they really should be level now. They have to be more clinical in front of goal. Bruno Fernandes. The ball with Pepe. Goalkeeper has it. Guerrero. On the ball, Ruben Dias. Good use of advantage by the referee. Joao Felix. Promising attack, this. Leao. Oh, didn't seem to be too much in that offside decision. Marcos Acuna. Oh, that's a really good run. Well, unable to direct it on the target. And a goal kick to come. Joao Cancelo. Here's Ronaldo. Pepe. And unable to keep possession. Martinez. It's with Guerrero. Pepe. Ruben Neves. Not much time to make up his mind. Silva. Joao Felix. Bruno Fernandes has it. Let's fly here. And the keeper more than equal to it. They take it short. Ronaldo Silva. Well, it had a chance, but off the crossbar. And a goal kick. Oh 
Di Maria. Marcos Acuna. Very quick thinking there. Well, it's been difficult for the Portuguese to get hold of the ball, but their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. Well, that's right, preserving the lead and doing it really well. Nicely timed tackle. Alvarez. Marcos Acuna, and the cross goes in, and he's gone and scored to level us again. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. So back underway, one goal apiece here. João Felix. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Can they forge ahead? And under pressure, that was a fine claim. They've lost it. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, he's through here. And a goal! Just like that, the back in front. Well, as you can see again, Fernandes plays a perfectly weighted pass beyond the defenders. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Well, as they kick off again, 2-1 the current state of affairs. Just cutting off the supply. And a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. Leal. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Di Maria. Here's Marcos Acuna. Well, very effective play in possession. Can he put it in? Blocked it brilliantly. Wonderful chance. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. Well, here it is again. And I don't expect keepers to save everything at their near post. But I think he should probably do better. He'll be a little bit disappointed with that. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Well, he successfully got past him. Felix, just the challenge that was required. Alvarez. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Joao Felix. That was a menacing attack, but tidied up. So, the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. So, back underway here, into the second half. Can he 
put them in front. Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, as you can see, they finished this really easily. They don't give the keeper a chance, do they? That's a good goal. On with the game then, 3-2, what will happen next? <laughs> Deciding to go inside, and the keeper got there, and comfortably. Ruben Neves. It's with Joao Cancelo. Oh, Portugal might be onto something. William Carvalho. Martinez. Oh, it might be. And it goes to square the game. What a contest this is turning. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. Joao Felix. This looks more than decent. Can he get them in front? And there is the goal! He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Well, as you can see here, Fernandes gets beyond the challenge of the defender and then the finish from Bernardo Silva demonstrates his ability to make the right run at the right time. What a good goal. Well, how about this? 4-3. Has a go. And the corner kick it is. What can they do with this one? As they look for inspiration. But he's gone short with it. Electing to cross into the centre. But it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Pepe not given time on the ball. William Carvalho. Leal. And that's the hat trick. Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle him. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. Not a scoreline we see all that often. 5-3. Dybala I must say this looks promising Well 
Now, will they be able to play it in behind the defence? Could play it in. Dybala. Back with Martinez. Nicely timed tackle. Can they hit on the break? All hands on deck. Joao Felix! It was an excellent example of how to break at pace. Well, that's counter-attacking football at its best. They switch on so quickly when they win the ball back. It deserved a goal. De Paul. It's with Dybala. Can he play it in? Firing it towards goal and blocked for now. Not a great pass. Martinez. Can he get one back? He can! He's given his team a real opportunity and momentum is with them. Well, as you'll see, it's not a good pass out from the back. It's on the wrong side of the plate he's trying to pass it to. It's intercepted and it's a good finish. Yes, of course it is, but it's not good defending all round. Well, I must say, I'd have to go back quite a few years to remember the last time I covered a game with a scoreline of 5-4. Oh, good-looking run. Chance to cross. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And that is going to be a free kick. Dias. The ball with Pepe. Deciding to give it to the keeper. Joao Cancelo. Ruben Neves. Leal. And here's Cancelo. And back with Felix. Oh, surely. And still an opportunity. Well, no damage done. Just 20 minutes remaining now. It is a decent looking attack here. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Something to worry about here. Well, I'm not sure the keeper particularly wanted that, but danger averted for now. Ruben Dias. Bruno Fernandes has it. Dias. Pepe. Silva. It's going to be a throw in for Portugal here. Dibala. Options in the middle. Takes the shot. Determined block. Just 15 minutes remaining. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, it could be on for him here. Well, clearly in the mood to make it a double, but fine goalkeeping. Well, he's playing really well today. That was another decent attempt. Well, opting for the short corner. Chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. Well, he's won the ball. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side.
Guerrero. It's with William Carvalho. Ruben Diaz. Well, it's a great advantage to any side when you're as comfortable on the ball as they are. Given away by Guerrero. Dybala. Well, just look at this again. He's so hard to knock off the ball once he gets going. Of course the defending could be better, but that's a great individual goal. Well, what an extraordinary scoreline. Does this game have more goals in it? He has teammates around him. Good tackle taken away. Well, these fans are pushing their team on here. They sense a winner's coming. Given the situation, a goal at this stage might well turn out to be a winner. Ronaldo Silva. Superb block. And the teams are level, and every corner counts at this juncture. Over it comes. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. On a time for composure on the ball. Di Maria. And turning in field, Angel Di Maria. Oh, there it is! Incredible! How about this for guts and courage? Can they see this out now? Well, as you can see, he's a great talent. What a run, what a goal, and what a player he is. The electronic board has been held in the air, and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Determined defending. Joao Felix. Could be a chance to break here. And it was a good counter attack in the making, but very alert defending. Will he finish? And it's a goal. Level again. What a match this is turning out to be. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. And a goal at this stage might well turn out to be decisive. And so the referee brings the 90 minutes to an end, all even here.
Well, the ball rolling again here. The first period of extra time. And you've got to wonder to what extent fatigue will play a part of this now. It's been an extremely competitive 90 minutes. Well, this is a really good game of football. Both sides have played well going forward. There's been plenty of chances, goals and a lot of near misses. It's been great entertainment. Yes, I mean, they're matching each other, attacking blow for attacking blow. Must take the lead here. In it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him, apparently. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. Now, what does Di Maria have in store for the defenders? Surely the equaliser. A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. Joao Cancelo. On to Silva. What a shocking pass, really. And Portugal will get the throw in. Ruben Neves return to Cancelo electing to cross into the centre oh a moment of pure class had to catch it perfectly and didn't he just well here it is again Cancelo's cross really does invite someone to attack it but I think the keeper has made a mistake here while it's a decent finish, it should go in at that near post. And that is going to be a free kick. Well, that is how to play advantage. Bruno Fernandes in with a chance. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. It's a short corner. And Bernardo Silva has it. They're using his body to good effect. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Marcos Acuna. Di Maria. The high press was on and that's a fantastic tackle. And they will be awarded a free kick for that. Well, the referee making it clear on a different day it could have been a booking Paredes Marcos Acuna now Dybala and a chance to level it excellent block excellent assessment of the situation at the back
Rafael Leao. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Dybala. It needs an accurate cross. Can he take the chance? Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Di Maria sliding it through. Martinez! First period of extra time completed. 15 minutes left, and... Marcos Well, the second period of extra time commences. What drama do we have in store for us? A very timely interception. Well, can they be creative from here? Quite possibly a yellow card as the flow was stopped. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Well, we had it on target, but it was never going to trouble the keeper. There's a slide draw pass. Oh, could be. And fine goalkeeping. Now, how about the short corner? Di Maria. Oh, maybe the equaliser. And a goal to square the game. Into the seat stuff. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Could go ahead. And there it is. Two goals in a matter of minutes. Incredible stuff. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? That's how to dispossess your opponent. On the attack in the closing phase. Well, the supporters think it's on. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. A corner kick, and who knows, this might represent the last chance to grab an equaliser. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, he has the measure of his man. And struggling to get the shot off. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Rafael Leao. 
on the ball Joao Felix William Carvalho oh good save time is not on the side this corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser and the short option preferred Fernandes and a fine stop oh, another corner kick conceded let's see what they do this time they favoured a short one here Bruno Fernandes using all his defensive acumen to cut it out and the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack but quick thinking defensively and the electronic board delivers the news two minutes of stoppage time well the fans are certainly playing their part here just listen to this noise useful looking ball A wonderful intervention. And the pass could do damage. This could be the equaliser. The final whistle. And it's gone the wrong way for Portugal in this one. Not at all the result they were hoping for. Stuart, sum it up for us. Well, I thought it was a really intense game. Lots of quality, lots of good individual displays. In the end, though, they won't be happy with the defeat, nor the manner of it, conceding so late on.